Hello everyone, now today is a massive pinch myself moment because I'm about to drive this World Series by Nissan race car lent to us by the team at Formula Car Hire. Now if you want to know more about them, click the link in our description to see their website. But first, maybe you should come with me for a ride. Wow, so you are riding on board with me. And I am literally just driving out the pit lane for the first time. This is my first go in this 450 horsepower, three litre V6 World Series by Nissan racing car. Now Lee, who runs Formula Car Hire, this is his baby. This is his, one of his pride and joys. And he's very kindly allowed me to take this car out to feel what something as extreme as a World Series Nissan car is like a mega. I'm just warming the car up. This is my first lap out on track. And as you can probably tell, it's quite wet out here. Oh my God, the gearbox. So what do I say? So the track is dumped. So please bear with me as I build up in speed. Oh, there we go. That's fine first. <laughs> so basically, Formula Car Hire, they allow you to choose from a selection of cars and Lee will come down and he can drive them at your event. He can take the cars out and demonstrate what these mad machines can do. And he's very kindly let me have a go in this 2002 Delara chassis, raced up until 2004, racing car, and I can't believe it. It is so extreme. And hopefully I'm gonna build up the confidence in a moment to get up to a speed where I can make some good noises. I'll give him a thumbs up. Let's let the engine get up to temperature. We need to get the oil temperature up to 75. I assume that's degrees. And I'm trying to remember to take the wet lines around these bends. We've got a six speed sequential pneumatically fired gearbox, which is like being shot in the backside by an automatic rifle. 450 horsepower, the throttle response of something I've never experienced before in my life and the sort of reactivity on the front axle. Oh my God, the front reactivity of this car. It's so razor sharp, so much so that I don't want to have another spin again in this bend. So let's be really ginger. Let's take that wet line nice and careful. So slippery on this track. This is my favorite track because it's the track I use, but I've never been so terrified on a race circuit. Not for a long time anyway. I'm going to get quiet for a lap and I'm going to give you a quiet lap where I'm just going to try and focus on driving and give you some engine noise. I don't think I'm anywhere near the tyre temps that's required for this. Oh my God, that was a big slide. For this to work. Right, I'm going to be quiet now. Headphones in.
So yeah, while the weather didn't want to play ball and we of course didn't get anywhere close to achieving a set fast lap time for this car, it was still pretty spectacular to drive Lee's really wonderful 2002 World Series by Nissan race car on our little racetrack. As you probably saw, I spent very little time anywhere close to full throttle. I don't think I got above 70 or 80% throttle. And even then, those moments lasted for about 0.2 seconds. But Lee has assured us that we might be able to get another go when the weather is a bit better, maybe next year. So hopefully we can bring the car back and set a respectable, maybe even lap record breaking time on our circuit. Best get subscribing to the channel so you don't miss out on that. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed this. If you did, of course, like the video. See you soon.